Hi roomies, we are back for Golf Therapy Thursdays and today I have Laurie with me. Lawrence is a Green Room member and a 16 handicapper from Riverside Oaks. Thank you for joining me, Lawrence. 15.2 if 15, you don't mind. 15.2. And Lawrence, along with some of the other male members of the Green Room, have been saying that some of the tips are a little bit female friendly and male non-friendly, yeah, right? Yeah, concur. And so Lawrence has agreed to join me today and we're going to play a hole with Lawrence and Anne instead of just Anne. So we're going to get a few ideas on some tips that are, you know, work for the guys but not the girls and vice versa and um, have a bit of fun as well. Looking forward to it. Cool. Let's go. This is our signature hole here at Muirfield. Par four, dog leg right, water on the right, trouble on the left, but don't listen to that Lawrence. Okay, here he goes. Oh, it's a nice one. Down the left-hand side. You take that one. <laughs> and we like that one. Oh, 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 I think it's just stopped short of the fairway bunker. We did, we got that one. <laughs> nice shot. So here we are, second shot on the 14th. Lawrence has, what distance would you say you've got there, Laurie? 40 meters. So what are you choosing to do here? Okay, well, what I'm going to do, I know because I'm quite a fluffy light, so I've got plenty of uh, grass under it. Yes. So I'm actually going to take a lob wedge. Lob wedge. And what sort of length swing would you need for 40 on a lob wedge? Uh, well, I, uh, oh, only a really short one. I'm half swing? Yeah, I won't even do a half swing. Okay, let's All see right, what you're made of. Really no thing. pressure. Okay, that's got to stop quick. Oh, over the back. A little bit too. Uh, didn't quite get under no, it. I didn't get under it. Not quite smooth enough. Bit short and sharp, I thought. Okay. Yeah, that no, didn't feel right. Bugger. Okay, so Lawrence has ended up over the back of the green, and we've got a really tight pin here. So it may be lob wedge again, Laurie. Yeah, I've got a 62 degree, 62. which is a bit bizarre. That, um, that is that very was the lofted. That's Cleveland that I had left <laughs> to choose from. So it wasn't a 60 degree. But in my head, I know that I can't decelerate if I decelerate. That's right, nice and positive. Sort of end up at my feet, so. Nice and positive. Use your body, get your body involved. A couple of practice swings. No trying to help it up. No, no, no scooping. No scooping, exactly. That's your middle name, isn't it? No scooping. <laughs> yeah, and no, no scooping. That's I, know. I do a few tips on that. Yes, no, I do. I'm getting ahead. <laughs> That's it, down and through. Oh, that's nice. If you had have added a little bit of wrist break on your backswing, it would have landed a bit softer. Just have a practice swing for me. A little bit more wrist break on the backswing. Yeah, that's right. That'll lift you up and give you a bit of a softer. Yeah, I've seen that on your video. I do watch it. Yeah, you don't listen to it, obviously. Okay, so we are on the 15th now at Muirfield, and this is a longish par three. Distance is about 155. So what club do you need, Laurie, for 155? Well, I'm not that good at um, sort of hitting a soft five, so I'm gonna hate to take a full six. So a full six is normally about 150 for you, is it? Oh, easy, yeah. Okay, okay. Yeah. So this is the difference between the guys and the girls. Obviously their strength. Hit it further. I think guys tend to be a little bit more positive as well than girls. All right, let's see what you can do here. It's a good shot. Oh, good that might be on the green. Oh yeah. Okay, good club choice. Right, nice, nice. He okay. likes the camera. I haven't played the uh, <laughs> hole for about three years. So Lawrence has hit a beautiful shot up onto the green, but we thought we'd add a bit of challenge because you know it's no fun just having a birdie putt, right? Correct. So we're going to make you pitch. So we've got a pretty good spot here, not easy. What club have you chosen, Lawrence? Uh, I've chosen the sandwich. 
sand wedge yeah. because because um, not to carry it all the way on haven't you yeah and stop it yeah exactly so we're going to carry it up and on okay all right <laughs> fancy all right so it sounds good does sound good you've got to have a plan right that's half the battle okay no scooping no no Oh, you got the slope you had picked. A little bit big. Again, a little bit more wrist break on the back swing would give you a higher, softer one. All right, so we thought we'd let Laurie have his birdie part. Just can't okay. let those go. They don't come around often enough, right? Downhill. Yep. What do you think, left to right, right to left? I'm trying to get good roll on the ball. Yeah, good idea. Get the speed. It's all about the speed, isn't it? Pace is the most important thing. Where's your line? Part, I'm not going to overthink it. Good. Go well. Where's your line? What are you aiming for? I'm actually going to aim slightly left. Yeah, I think so. Yeah. About a foot maybe. How long? Maybe a foot left. No, I think I was going to say a foot. And then get the, the pace is the key here. Let's see if he can make his par. Pressure. Pressure, pressure. This to get into the Masters playoff. That's it. Oh my god. Imagine he's going to be the top picture of the player. Has he got the bottom? Oh. A little bit too much hands and wrists, not enough shoulders. Do that one again for us. Too much what? Not, that was too much hands and wrists, not enough shoulders. Too much hands and wrists, was it? Okay. Yeah, have a practice straight. Shoulders. Yeah, that's it. Think pendulum. Yeah, no. You're aiming a bit too far left there. You yeah. I bet it goes in. All right. Who's Show off. Who's a <laughs> <laughs> Nice. <laughs>